a murderer. Max, she's after us. She's one of them. Max, it's your duty as a detective. Huh. Duty? That's the best you can do. Too late, Max. Back off, You babe. are under arrest Max, for murder. Stay back. I'm doing phone. this for you, Max. Max. Bullet in the head. Glad. Too late, Max. Max. You are under arrest for murder. I'm doing this for you, Max. A bullet in the head. I can end the pain. Amidst the wreckage of your own making. Do you stay there, eyes squeezed shut, afraid to move, hoping to bleed to death? Or do you crawl out, help your loved ones, make sure the fire doesn't spread, try to fix it? This is your final warning. We have surrounded the building. Drop your weapons and come out with your hands above your head. All this time, we got the fable of Sleeping Beauty wrong. All units are in position. We are ready to go. The prince didn't kiss her to wake her up. No one who slept for a hundred years is likely to wake up. Okay, people. Get ready to go in. We are gonna hit the place. It was the other way around. He kisses her to wake himself up from the nightmare that has brought him there.
hospital earlier tonight. I had thought things couldn't get any worse. I was wrong. Fast forward from that to Winterson's body at the hospital morgue. I was a murderer, a cop killer. There are things in life you cannot choose, how you feel. I had lain at the bottom of the hole long enough. Too long. Give up! You have nowhere to run! The cleaning company commandos were coming for me. I needed a gun. I needed to get past them. Hope the painkillers were enough to keep me on my feet. security guard had dropped his gun in the doorway. Artillery. That was the plan, and we are sticking to it. I'm saying...
heed her words. Maybe we can yet solve this peacefully. Come at me! construction site I had been ready to give myself in. There would have been no answers, no second chance. Nothing would be fixed. I had to solve the case on my own. Mona was still the answer. I caught glimpses of her out of the corner of my eye, felt her presence everywhere I went. I was trying to trace her path, recreate the winding course of the magic bullet in her head. I couldn't find her. I drove out of the city in the direction Mona had pointed me, to a man who specialized in answers. The architecture of Alfred Woden's manor had its origins in European darkness along with the inner circle. Mr. Payne, I've been expecting you. The only true reason why men fight wars, love. The score on Mona Sachs? Next question. Fine. Why is the inner circle trying to kill me? I am dying. Cancer. Power has leaked through my fingers. There was a rebellion. A renegade faction has pushed the society into a civil war. Everyone who resists is assassinated. We have been reduced to fighting mob wars. Vinny Gagnitti? Vladimir Lem. I knew the answer before he told me. Vlad had lied. The cleaning company commandos were his men. Vladimir Lem has belonged to the society for many years. Gogniti is going to die in the hands of the Inner Circle Renegade. Then he is coming for me, his one-time mentor. I left Woden at the door of his panic room. By talking of fate, Vlad had been asking for my blessing to his plan to murder me. I've been keeping to the backbeat, reacting to Vlad's moves, cleaning up after him. No more. taken bicycle helmet girl to his secret mothership, hidden behind the moon. To save her, Captain Baseball Bat Boy must brave the cold void filled with demons nefarious minds. Bases loaded. Fastball! Get him! That boy has escaped Demon's trap. But can he save Bicycle Helmet Girl before Maxwell's demon turns the world into a dreaded closed system? A Hollywood franchise that goes perpetually on forever? Go. Find out in the next episode of the Adventures of Captain Baseball Bat Boy. A glass of Gold Touch Brandy to make you... Hi.
Americans avenge your 9mm handgun when it's too late to protect your luck. <laughs> A glass of Gold Touch Brandy to make you feel rich and famous. Ammunition absolutely free. Sing cleaning products. After dirty business, come clean with us. That's 555 Clean. Clean Sing cleaning products. The choice of crime scene cleanup services. Where is she? Where is she? Dangerous liaison. <laughs> Call Just talk. Dangerous liaisons. Our girls are eager to hear. Interfectum. 600 milligrams. A serious Anything? No, but we'll see step through the door, and he'll see us push his face and shoot him dead. Did you hear something? No. Shut up, so he won't hear us. I think I should go take a look. Not shoot! <laughs>
cleaning company vans, the cleaner jumpsuits, the illegal firearms, the hard evidence that proved Vlad was behind it all. Men, capture them. Your word is our command, my lady. Mama? Yes, good. My precious boy, a noble lord is dead. A vile crime against our illustrious name. A crime that shall not go unpunished. My lord! Unhand her, you brutes! Yes, good.
Catch! Is it over? Did somebody get them? Are they dead? Is it safe? No! It's pain! You can get away! Oh, you can't hide! <laughs> Vlad and Mona were on a crash course. If I'd find one, the odds were I'd find the other. Vlad was after Vinny. He had left me a map to follow. You have one new message. Vlad, it's me. Where are you? I need you. I'm on my way to the construction site now. Winterson. I'll do it. I'll take care of them both for you. I don't know. Is this a crime? Is it against the law to be happy? They haven't seen you with my boy. Haven't seen you with me. Miss you. Call me. The gilding on the mask had cracked to reveal the rot underneath. Winterson's confession didn't wash away my guilt. It made me feel worse. I had a meeting scheduled with Vlad at Vinny's place. Mark Cleaner! Waste them! Get him before they get out! I was still a couple of blocks away from Vinny's place. I had to get moving. One of ours, yeah. Crashed in from the street. Who was driving it? One of ours, they're in trouble. We gotta get him out of there. Not so long ago, the V-Tags had bloomed everywhere in the city. Now they only remained in the worst neighborhoods, the monster's grave. battle zone in a mob war between Vlad's men and Vinny's mobsters. Who's the man with nothing to lose? The dick Jeff. Stranded. Dick Justice. Alone, hard-boiled, fugitive guy. 
framed for the murder of his wife. No one of West Burke Bank I read the criminal underworld just in the city's no. heart of darkness. <laughs> the night was his death. Vinny's used car lot was up ahead. I had to find a way down to the street. I could use it. I'm moving. What about it? Put one foot in front of the other. You're here. 
around you. Where the hell have you been? What took you so long? Where's the rest of you? You're the reinforcements Vinny promised us, right? Who else? Only it's just me. The cleaners got the rest. God damn it, they're killing us like flies! I guess one extra gun's better than nothing. Okay, let's go! Alright, we'll head to the lot. We need to keep those Russians away from the boss. Yeah, uh, keep them away from the... the captain. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry, I, I know it's nothing to laugh about. Deadly serious. The adventures of Captain Big Head got nitty. Hey, enough! We got a job to do! Training cats and dogs here! For I'm a rain dog. Stay sharp. We're gonna rain something else too when the cleaning show up. You? Why does this keep happening to me? Pain, you gotta help me. There's a freaking bomb in here. If I take the head off, it blows. Bye bye, Vinny. You're a freaking cop. You gotta help me. How did this happen? The Russian tricked me. Join the club. I can help you get him. I can. I swear, you get me out of this and I can help you get him. You've got yourself a deal. Me. You gotta protect me. We gotta get out of here. 
through the backyard! I didn't buy Vinny's promise to help me, but I was willing to do anything to complicate Vlad's plans. Pain! Cover me! Cover me! We gotta get through there! Pain, what are you waiting for? Don't let them get me! Kill them! Kill them! Let's go! Oh man, Payne! There's more of them out there! They're coming over the wall! You gotta get me out of here! the elevator up to my place. We'll get out through there. Let's go, Payne! Get him, Payne! You gotta protect me! We gotta get to the elevator! Fucking much. Nothing nerdy about it. I'm a collector. Hey, 
lots of tough guys are into this stuff. Frankie was into this stuff. He was a fucking tough guy. Hey, just wait till I sell my collection online. Just you wait. Nerd. Hey, let's see who's the nerd when I'm a millionaire. We gotta get out of here somehow. Gotta figure something out. Think, Vinny. Think. Not at all fun way. Vinny needed Mona as much as I did. We'll try to find Mona Sachs. She can disarm the bomb. Are you crazy? She's just as bad as the Russian. She's part of the same fucking crew. You're delusional. I was desperate enough to look for Mona at the fun house. I got a bad feeling about this. Max, dearest of all my friends. Drop your gun or the bomb goes. I had a bomb ticking in my head. No amount of painkillers would disable it. Vlad and his men left after they were done with Vinny and me. I don't know how Mona came to be there. I can only speculate. 
it's clear that she was after Vlad. Max. She must have gotten there after he had left. Otherwise, he'd have been dead, and she wouldn't have come after me. She came to get me through the fire. Vlad had terminated Vinny's tragicomic existence with the push of a button. Ouch. Poor guy. Poor bastard. Max. She found me where Vlad had left me lying in a pool of blood on her floor. Max, come on. Time to wake up. Death is inevitable. Our fear of it makes us play safe, blocks out emotion. It's a losing game. Without passion, you're already dead. It's all a matter of perspective, tied to time and place, love and friendship, life and death. Vlad had led me to Mona's apartment at gunpoint. Just missed you at Vodka and at Vinny's. Third time is the charm. We can't get him up here. The head is too big to fit through the door. Let Vinny stay in the funhouse. That's where he belongs. I'll get to him in a moment. Ironic, isn't it? What is? How you fell for the killer working for the man who got your family killed. Love is blind. Everything is subjective. Choices, answers, good and evil. Woden sent the Project Valhalla file to the DA to put a scare on him. Your family paid the price. Mona is like me, just in the opposite camp. Killing the society members allied with me. How funny is that? I hate to do this, but you know how you are. You would never let it go. Einstein was right. Time is relative to the observer. When you're looking down the barrel of a gun, time slows down. Your whole life flashes by, heartbreak and scars. Stay with it. 
and you can live a lifetime in that split second. Besides, a gentleman always avenges the insults done to his lady. You did kill Wintersome. In the dream, I was an invisible ghost hovering outside my body. Detective Pay, boss is already here. He's waiting for you inside. Hope you haven't had your lunch yet. This one's bad. A crime of passion. This one's yours, Payne. You're the only one who could solve it. A bullet it. in the head. The killer's looking for an answer, but he's looking for it in the wrong place. He should be looking for it in his own head. The suspect is ready for a lineup. You should hurry, Payne, or you'll miss him. Oh! His heart broke. Damn it, we're losing him. Give him hope! Six milligrams! Charge! Clear! Clear! Nothing! Go again, 300! NYPD, drop the gun! What are you gonna do about it, pal? Clear. We're all guilty Clear. of something if you look hard enough. Doctor, again, once more, 350, charge! Time to wake up. That won't help a thing. The bullet in my head brought me to you. Max, come on. Time to wake up. She was beautiful. I hated her for making me feel this way. Now that I was with her, I was reluctant to hear her answers. You okay? Vlad was headed to Woden's Manor. <sighs> don't be stupid. You're not in shape to go anywhere. You'll die. I don't care. This isn't your fight, Max. You can walk away. I'm asking you. I didn't deserve to walk away. There are no happy endings. You're coming with me. It was too late. I couldn't trust her. Not before I had seen this through. Vlad was right. There are no choices. Nothing but a straight line. The illusion comes afterwards. When you ask, why me? And what if? When you look back, see the branches. Like a pruned bonsai tree. Or a forked lightning. If you had done something differently, it wouldn't be you. It would be someone else looking back. Asking a different set of questions.
showtime. I'll go down first. Cover me from here. There! Alert! They're here! Damn! I'll climb down. No, stay there. I'll take the first floor, you take the second. Okay. I'm not sure I can... Incoming! Thank <laughs> you. 
We work our way deeper into the building. Look for Woden or Vlad. All right. I need back. Cover me! Of all my friends, I wouldn't have it any other way. I'm so glad we are together in this. Yes, sir. Woden and the gold are in the panic room. All we need to do is get in. There is no rush. It's not like they are going anywhere. The explosives are in place, sir. We are going to make a beautiful exit. Woden's bodyguards had betrayed him and joined Vlad. There was still time. They hadn't gotten to him yet. The panic room was at the back of the manor. Saxon Payne, they're already inside. They're extremely dangerous. We need to stop them before... Mona was still on the case. Up ahead. 
event. See you there. Here, let me. This way. Mona knew the man. She was working for Lord. Glad he told me the truth. Mona, wait. Stop. This is love. When someone drags you from the wreckage when you have given in, ready to just lie there and die. I told you not to come here. It's my job to clear up this mess and you're a part of it. Throw away your guns. This is love. When someone, no matter what the cost, shows you there is hope, a choice, that you can put down your gun. See? I can't do it. You're a bastard, Max. This is love. Love hurts. I was so looking forward to you two killing each other. Ah, oh, you can't have everything. I had been here before. Ground Zero. You are making me look incompetent by refusing to die. Stop. I am sorry. Enough! A bomb went off in my head. The bullet lodged in my brain moved to fatal, microscopic distance. The killing has gone too far. I have only begun. It's better to reign in hell than serve in heaven. You flatter yourself. Demented fool! <laughs> I felt the rise of that old familiar feeling. I hated it. I welcomed it. Everything was clear again. No more ambiguities, no more questions. No gun when you need one! <coughs> one last thing left to do. I was compelled to give Vlad his gun back. One bullet at a time. He's behind me! Hold him off! And give me a gun! We can still kiss and make up, Max! It's good that the women are out of the way. They only complicate matters. Take cover! He set off the of bomb! Course. The panic room! To the panic room! They're gonna blow!
is wrong with you, Max? Why don't you just die? You hate life. You're miserable all the time. Afraid to enjoy yourself even a little. Face it, you might as well be dead already. Do yourself a favor. Give up! Hey! these things, Max. One of these days, it's going to get you killed.
to play it? Come! You want to be a bad boy, Max? You think you can outsmart me? to be the hero. chance is to turn around and face it, but it's like kissing the lips of your dead love, darkness waiting in the hole of the mouth. We are willing to suffer, to die for the things we care about. For love, for the right choices. Because of her, I had solved the case, my case, all of it. Who I am. It's gonna be all right. Uh. <laughs> God, I turned out to be such a damsel in distress. She was dead. The bullet in her head had come to the end of its slow motion journey. Stay sharp. We're going in. Go, go, go! It is almost morning, waking up from the American dream. Jesus! My God! What the hell went on in here? They are all dead. Now, like all my loves, she is mine forever. She has brought me here to this moment of clarity where time slows down and I choose to look back to see myself. And in that act of seeing, I am reborn. Down here, this way, there! You see? Oh my God. He's got a live one here! Detective Payne? He's still alive! We need a medic in here, now! He's still alive! I had a dream of my wife. She was dead. But it was all right. <laughs> 